Popular TikTok videos about a common form of birth control often portray painful experience and mistrust in healthcare. That's according to new research from Duke Health about intrauterine devices or IUDs. CBS 17's Liz Ortiz is here with why health experts say this research can help improve patient care. Liz. All right, Angela, the hashtag IUD has 1.3 billion views on TikTok. Doctors say knowing what patients see on social media can help them better understand a patient's concerns and provide accurate information about IUDs. It's a common form of birth control. An intrauterine device, or IUD, is a small plastic T-shaped device that's inserted into the uterus. People are talking about it. The hashtag IUD is popular with over a billion views on TikTok. I'm a millennial on TikTok, and um, as I was scrolling through my own For You page, I would see these videos about negative experiences about IUDs. Dr. Jenny Wu is a resident OBGYN physician at Duke University. And I'm seeing patients in clinic, and I felt like a lot of my patients were um, choosing not to get an IUD and when you ask them a little bit more about that they said it was related to what they saw online what they saw on TikTok. Dr. Wu alongside other Duke Health researchers decided to look into this further. They took the top 100 most viewed TikTok videos with the hashtag IUD. Findings show most of the videos about personal patient experiences with getting an IUD placed or removed were negative. So the majority of them were negative associated mostly with pain and side effects related to the IUD. Um, there was a significant um, quarter that talked about desire for anesthesia, and then a lot of these videos really highlighted a distrust that they felt with their healthcare professional. Dr. Wu says this is an important study for healthcare professionals to better understand where patients are coming from and what they're worried about. So I don't want getting an IUD to be a traumatic experience for women um, because it's important for them to keep seeing us to get their routine pap smears, to get STI testing. And Dr. Wu encourages patients to talk with their doctor about what an IUD entails and ways to manage pain. Guys.